Thunder E, what's going on? Ah, uh, not much. Uh, what are you calling me off? I am calling you off on Google Talk off my Motorola Zoom. Nice, nice. Nice, nice. All right. Um, but audio quality is pretty good. Yeah, yeah. I can, I can hear you pretty well, too. Good enough. Well, uh, picture quality, I can't see you now. I don't know where your camera is facing. <laughs> okay, I can see your hands. Looks, it's pretty good. It's clear. It's, can you move close? Okay. Yeah, I do see you. Um, looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. Um, it's, if I maximize this, let me see how it looks. <laughs> All right, it's a little choppy. Not choppy, but a little um, you know, fuzzy. A little fuzzy, but, man. But it actually looks pretty good. Yeah, that's cool, that's cool. In case you guys, I know we didn't do an intro here, just wanted to go right into the call. But um, obviously I'm Boma from BW1.com, this is Thunder E. We're doing a uh, Google Talk uh, video call using a Motorola Zoom. It's one of the features in Android 3.0 on tablets. And um, the cool thing is, well, obviously here we're using the front-facing camera, but I can also, with the controls when you tap on the screen, that give you the, uh, they give you mute, go back to typing a message, you can go back to message chat, or you can hit this button, and it switches to the rear camera instead. And you can see there, got my phone in focus there. And you can um, zoom in if you wanted to. Thunder, you can see it on his side too. Yes, it's giving me a headache. <laughs> but um, that's, the, that's, that's using the rear camera. And um, overall, um, what do you think of it so far? As far as oh, the premiere it's, it's end? It's, it's, I mean, like I said, the audio quality is clear. I guess also, you know, just for the fact that, you know, with uh, Google, uh, Google Voice, they've had audio quality um, experience for a, long, for a while. Uh, picture quality is not bad. It's okay. Like I said, if I expand my screen here on my computer, it looks fuzzy. Uh, but with the little window it looks good. I don't know how it looks on the, on the uh, tablet, but um, so far it looks good. Uh, I think, you know, it'd be interesting to see how down the line, you know, it does with competitors like Skype, Quick, and you know, yeah. also FaceTime too, technically. So, Definitely. Um, you know, it'll be interesting to see how all those come together. And, I think, you know, I think there's going to be another they'll be able, they'll wait to merge all or whatever. What have you I think there's going to be another sort of sort of minor war between all these mobile messages coming soon. I'm going to talk yeah. about that at some point because I think all of them have some really interesting things, and also with a lot of with a lot of these video chat servers and front facing cameras, it's going to be pretty interesting. As far as you look, you look really good from this side as far as the video quality is concerned. I know um, you're on your desktop using a webcam, on an external webcam. Those usually are better. I know when we tried this on using your laptop when we were testing it out, the quality did degrade down just a little bit and it was a little bit choppy. Yeah. So that might be something, you know, people might want to look out for if, you, if, the, other, if the person on the other end has a laptop. That might be some might be some choppiness there, and you have a pretty good laptop. I think you have a, a pretty decent laptop, so it's not yeah. it's, it's not like it's not like you got one of those netbooks that are worth two hundred bucks. <laughs> yeah, it was it was strange that happened, but um, um, I maybe it's the the webcam off the laptop. Um, you know what? Um, later on we'll probably test it. I have I have an external webcam. I can either connect to my laptop, see if it's just the inbuilt webcam in there. Yeah, that was the issue. That'd be yeah. something to point out definitely definitely in our reviews. Um, okay, one thing we forgot to mention in the original um, recording of this uh, video is that you can't do anything else really while you're doing video chat. You know, they taught all this multitasking, but you can't do anything else. So, as you can see, thundering in, reading away on a screen. And um, let's say we want to go check our email or maybe even go on the web browser. Now, you can go into it, and I'm pretty sure that Thundery can hear me. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you, but the screen is paused, so there is no video. So just a pause screen with a pause sign on it. So it's paused, so you can't really do anything else. That kind of stinks. So you, they can't watch you doing something else. I can watch him doing plenty of things on his desktop, but they can't watch me doing something else. Or what would be nice is that if they had a sort of a small little window that kind of floated around, maybe in the top right corner or top left corner or whatever, wherever you wanted to put it, or maybe even a widget on the desktop, so you can still see the video while you're doing some other things cutting on this multitasking and this is something they should definitely do because a lot of people with, with webcams and you do video chat usually doing one thing and then doing something else at the same time while talking usually but um yeah. you, can, you can't hit the multitask button here and um not the multitask but the app manager button here and brings you back into the video and the video should start playing again you should start seeing me see my hands jazz yeah. hands <laughs> 
But um, yeah, so pretty much you can't do anything else when you're in video chat. And, even, and when you're in it, you try to hit that multi, uh, the app button there and say, okay, I used it that time. A couple of times it blocked it actually. So, but um, yeah, I just wanted to add that in. So now to the rest of the review. Cool, cool. Um, that's pretty much it. Thank All you. Right. All right. This is Enjoy Bowman. the tablet, buddy. <laughs> this is Bowman here from VW1.com, and we just did a video using Google Talk with video chat on a Motorola Zoom talking to somebody else from a desktop. We did talk from a laptop. Like I said, it was a little bit choppy. One thing we weren't able to do just yet is talk um, from Zoom to Zoom, but maybe that's something we can do in the future, or I'm, I'm not sure in that regard. I'm pretty sure a lot of people that are going to be buying this currently are probably going to be talking to people that already have... Uh, uh, webcams on their desktop or on their laptop or something like that so but um, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube page so you can check out all the videos that we have with the Motorola um, Zoom coming uh, hit us up on our Facebook fan page facebook.com slash bw1.com hit up on Twitter and always remember to live your tech world in high definition